So I'm starting a new telescope build and the first thing that came in the mail today was from OPT was William Optics. It's their Zenith Star Z61. It's a doublet refracting telescope. Um, as you can see, it came with this really nice, secure, padded, sturdy bag, travel bag, really, really nice. So without further ado, let's just get into it and see what we got here. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is really nice. Wow, I'm still shocked that they included this bag. This is really nice. And it looks like it has the cutout for the William Optics 32 millimeter guide scope, which I have on order. And I'll do a review for that once I get it, but that's really nice that that's included in there. Um, it looks like they included some probably screws for the dovetail. And wow, would you just look at that? That is really nice. Let's take a closer look. Wow, look at that. That is really nice. I am super happy with this. Let's take a closer look inside. Look at that. Oh, wow. All right, so that is a Batonoff mask. And I had no idea that this was gonna come with that. Um, so basically, if you don't know a Batonoff mask, it just helps you um, focus in tighter on stars. It makes it a lot easier to focus because as everybody knows, focus is the most important thing of astrophotography. Super happy with this. So yeah, I 100% recommend this if you're on the fence with this. Um, the build quality alone is incredible. And man, I just can't wait to take this out and uh, see what this bad boy can do. Wow, this is an amazing telescope, and I'm super happy that I decided to go with the William Optics. Um, just because of this build quality is absolutely incredible. It just feels solid, and I'm just super happy with it. Um, just to go over a few of the important specs, um, it's a 61 millimeter aperture on a 360 millimeter focal length. The tube itself is 230 millimeter and it has a focal ratio of 5.9 um, and the total weight of it is about 3.2 pounds. Um, it's just really nice, I can't even get over it. Um, one thing I do recommend people get and I have also ordered myself, which I will do a review on that once I get it with this particular scope, is the William Optics field flattener for DSLR. Um, so it'll just mount right here and then you'll start your DSLR train right here. Um, it'll just help to flatten out the stars on, a, on the picture um, near the corners. Um, so it'll just, it'll just look a lot cleaner and look a lot nicer. Um, but yeah, man, I'm super happy with this. If you're on the fence or thinking about getting this, it's worth every penny. I absolutely 100% recommend it. But anyways, thank you guys for watching this. If you enjoyed it, please leave a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. And also drop a sub if you wanna see me finish the rest of this telescope and also maybe follow me on the rest of my astro adventures. So until then, clear skies.